What's up, YouTube? Thanks for coming and checking out the Fat Guy Builds, where this fat guy here builds stuff for you, does stuff. Today, Mishimoto X Pipe 2020 Ford Mustang GT. I'm guessing it's going to sound good, but uh, let's find out. Here's the part number for the X Pipe M M E X H dash M U S eight dash. 15 XP. So here's the X pipe. Don't mind all the bolts. Uh, the only thing I kind of don't like about the kit is the style of the clamp. And it doesn't come with washers here. So what happened on my H pipe on mine was that this metal got messed up because the nut dug into it. So grab some washers, put some washers here. And then you'll be good. Grab a 15 millimeter deep socket and you're going to loosen all four of these that hold these two clamps tight. Now to move the clamps you have these little safety clips so you're going to use a flathead. You're going to pull the safety clip so that it um, goes past that little nipple Just keep hitting it you see how there's a nipple here that's what it latches on so you got to do that on both sides and then put hit knock this till it passes the end of this pipe now we're gonna pull down the rest of the exhaust okay so you have a bolt here a bolt here A bolt up there and a bolt here on both sides you're gonna have a connector for the uh, actuator valves for the exhaust so you're gonna unplug that and then there's a clip so you're gonna pop this clip out of the body here that way you're not hung up on anything when you try to lower this down you're gonna undo these bolts here these bolts um, aren't just going to let this thing fall. These are hooked. at the Up here, there's a hook that goes in a hole. See where my finger went? So it'll still stay here. So you get these bolts out. Then you have one person support that in. Then the person back here just lifts this section up a little bit. And then gets these unhooked from the frame. And then slowly lower it to the ground. You're going to take the X-pipe. Line it up on top of the exhaust, like so. X-pipe closest to this side. This goes down. Then over here, the Mishimoto M should be the right way up if you're looking at it from under the car. And then we're gonna take a marker and we're gonna mark the exhaust where it's flush here on this one. Now that we have the mark here, we're gonna take a Sawzall and we're gonna do a straight cut. So don't cut it sideways like this, don't cut it sideways like that. You want this to be straight down. So you want it to be, you know, not angled in any direction, obviously. Take your front factory clamps, put them back on over the nipple, seat them. Then you're gonna take the X pipe with the X towards the front you're going to push it in as far as it'll go. Then you're going to make sure back here that the pipes are not like tweaked left or, you know, left or right like this. These should be even like this. So you do that. Then torque down these 15 millimeter nuts. So for some reason, this 2020 has these heat shields welded on. So all I'm going to use is a flapper disc, a sandpaper flapper disc, and I'm going to just grind the welds off slowly until the heat shield comes off. So the heat shield, I ground out this, cut it, then I just bent the heat shield back and forth. It ripped here. No big deal. I'm going to leave that. And then I ground off the rest of the weld that was just chilling here 
so now it's nice and flat. Now we're going to hang this by the factory hangers and then we'll get to putting this together with the x-pipe. We got both sides up now and what you're going to do is you're going to visualize where the center is and you're going to want to center this thing so that half of the clamp is on this pipe half of the clamp is on this pipe. To get the tips to line up a little bit we will have to give a little upward pressure here. I'm going to tighten down this clamp here and then I'll tighten down the whatever side we're doing we'll tighten down that clamp in the center of the two pipes. Alright so let's hear what quiet sounds like. Alright let's hear what track sounds like.